Hey yo, I'm Suxy and welcome back. Today's video, I've just got a quick one here covering the new Battle Pass system in Modern Warfare 2. Uh, in advance, I'm sorry for my voice. I have a little bit of a cough, so I sound kind of scratchy, kind of raspy. But instead of their linear progression system where you just go up a single track, they have now resorted to this grid system kind of thing. It's confusing to look at right off the rip, but it's actually quite simple, and it gives the player a little bit more choice when it comes to the direction uh, that they want to go for the content that they unlock. And ultimately, you're going to result in ending in the same spot if you play enough or decide to buy it out. You'll always get the same stuff as everyone else. But um, the way it works is you'll start out with one of these tiles here. Um, you go inside the tile, and you get to select one, two, three, four, and five. Using the tokens down on the bottom screen there, the bottom right of the screen. Um, these tokens you earn by, you know, just playing the game, earning XP. You can play DMZ, Warzone, multiplayer, uh, co-op, anywhere you earn XP. These tokens will come up and you can use these tokens to then unlock one of these nodes in here. So the small nodes first, the small squares, are what you unlock first. Once you unlock all four small squares inside one of the grids, you can then unlock the, you know, big square, which will then finish off the grid, and it'll bring you into this, like, gold highlighted square instead of having it, like, you know, green. Green is a square that is still progressing, so once you unlock one of these squares, you'll have the choice to go either up or to the right. So if I unlock A1, a2 and A3 will then become available for me to unlock. I can choose to either go for A2 or I can choose to go for A3. It's entirely up to me. Um, you know, it's not a very complicated system. Vault Edition users will also get 55 free tokens right off the rip. You don't have to play for them or anything. They're just given to you, so you can basically have half of the Battle Pass unlocked, like I do. If you didn't get the Ultimate Edition, then you have to grind for your tokens or, you know, purchase them. Yeah, you basically get to choose the direction of where you want to go. Like, say, oh, I want the new SMG in A6, so I would go A0, A1, A3, and A6. Or I want the new sniper rifle in A7. I would go A0, A1, A2, A4, A7. Just remember, you have to unlock all four of the little square nodes inside one of these, uh, one of these sections here. You have to unlock all these four down here. Then you unlock this, that completes the sector. So for me, I have two tokens. I'm not sure if I want to go for A9, A11, or A16. I think I'll go for A11. And I will go for the points and this blueprint. There you go. I've unlocked two, but I still have to get three more tokens. As you can see, this big part of the sector is locked until I unlock these two. And then it unlocks. I purchased that, this entire sector is done, I can move on to A14. So yeah, that's basically it for this video. It was super quick, super simple battle pass system, gives you a little bit more freedom for what you choose. If you enjoyed, or if this helped you out, I'd appreciate it if you subscribe to the channel, like the video, it helps me out a lot, and I'll see you guys in the next one.